Welcome to the Magnify Your Miracles podcast. Get ready to be inspired, uplifted, and connected to the miraculous energy of unconditional love that I call Mother Mary. If you're a highly sensitive, highly creative entrepreneur or light worker, and you want to magnify your impact and your intuition, you are in the right place. I'm your host, Reverend Francis Faden, interfaith minister, intuitive coach, and author of Meditation is Friendship with God. I can't wait to share miraculous stories, books, meditations, messages, and interviews with other miraculous light workers just like you. Are you ready to magnify your miracles? What are we waiting for? Let's get started. Hello, my miraculous friend. Welcome to another episode of the Magnify Your Miracles podcast. And before we get into today's episode, I want to tell you two really important things. One is that we're coming up on the month of August, and it's one of the most special months to connect with Mother Mary's energy. So because of that, today's episode is going to be an encore of the miracle meditation that I did to prepare you for the month of May. May and August are really powerful months for Mother Mary. And she wanted me to give the opportunity to listen to this meditation again and really help you get into the field of miracles. The second thing I want to share with you is that if you really want to start magnifying your miracles and you want to draw close to Mother Mary, I invite you to to join me for the four-week intensive training that begins in August, Mother Mary's Healing Energy Activation. Mother Mary herself, through these four calls, will be activating the healing energy in your hands, in your body. She'll be showing you how to use that energy to bless and heal yourself, to magnify your energy through prayer, and to be sending healing energy out to the planet, as well as how to share this energy with other people. It's going to be a very powerful time, and if you've been looking for a way to connect with Mother Mary, to deepen your connection with her, I highly recommend that you join us. You can go to francisfaden.com forward slash healing energy activation, or it's right there on my homepage. And I would love to have you join me and really draw closer to Mother Mary and help have her help you awaken to your own innate healing ability that is already there. Very, very powerful time. All right, my friends, so I hope that you enjoy this episode and that you really are able to step into that beautiful field of miraculous energy. Hello, my miraculous friend, and welcome to another episode of the Magnify Your Miracles podcast. This is Reverend Francis Faden, and I'm so grateful to get to spend this very sacred time with you. Today, we are going to be doing a a miracle meditation, a guided meditation So if you're driving, this is not the episode for you to listen to because I am going to be taking you through a guided meditation and encouraging you to close your eyes. And before we get into the meat of the meditation, let's just get ourselves ready by taking a few deep breaths, grounding and centering, really letting ourselves start to get more and more receptive, opening ourselves up to that beautiful divine presence. Letting go of whatever happened before, whatever's going to happen later, and just coming deeply into the now. And whatever it is that you would love to experience, just let yourself imagine that you have experienced that. Let that feeling flood your body, mind, spirit. And knowing that whatever it is that you're desiring is what the universe is desiring to give you feeling that beautiful gratitude. Let's take one more deep breath together and we can begin. All right, my friend. Well, we're going to be doing things just a little bit differently today. Mother Mary has given me some guidance to help you. And the first thing I want to tell you is that I'm recording this in the month of April. We're getting ready for the month of May. And for those of you who have worked with me for a while, or if you work with Mother Mary, you'll know that May is the month of miracles. It is a beautiful time to focus on what you would love to experience, any miracles you would love to have in any area of your life, big or small, doesn't really matter. The energy is so potent in the month of May because Mother Mary's energy is so palpable. 
And one of the things that she wanted me to start sharing with you is that I refer to her as Mother Mary, but really what she represents is the field of unconditional love. It's a field of energy, the energy of unconditional love. And so I relate to this beautiful field of energy by calling it Mother Mary, because that's how she appeared to me. But the truth is, is she's wanting me to take you into this field of energy, because this is the field of miracles. This is where miracles are naturally and spontaneously occurring all the time. And so she really is wanting me to give this to you as a gift so that you can come back and visit this beautiful field of energy anytime that you want to. So I'm going to ask you now to get yourself in a comfortable position and close your eyes. We're going to let ourselves use your beautiful God-given power of imagination known as the mind's eye. And as you're breathing in, I'm going to ask you to let yourself see and feel a little ball of golden light right in the middle of the chest. And as you're breathing out, letting go of any heaviness, anything that you no longer need, breathing in light, breathing in expansion, and breathing out anything that's old that you no longer need, and letting that go. And letting that beautiful golden light continue to expand until you feel it fill the entire chest area, front and back, inside and out. Now we know that this beautiful golden light vibration is the vibration that your higher self lives in at all times. We're just going to increase our awareness of what's already here. So on the next inhalation, let yourself see this energy moving down the arms into the hands and the fingers moving down the body into the legs, the feet, the toes, moving up the head into the neck until you see and feel yourself completely filled with this beautiful golden light vibration. And now imagine, if you will, that you can see and feel Mother Mary's energy standing behind you and very gently putting her hands on your shoulders. And as she's putting her hands on your shoulders, let yourself feel the energy coming from her hands and merging with your body, merging with your energy field. Until you can feel this beautiful energy of oneness. And very gently, Mother Mary is now guiding you to lean back against her. You might even hear her heartbeat as your head rests on her heart chakra, feeling your back up against her body. And then as you are breathing and feeling her peace enveloping you, You start to see and feel her body and your body merging, both merging into this field of energy that we're just going to call the field of unconditional love. Mother Mary's beautiful form starts to become fluid. You feel your own body starting to melt in and become fluid as well and melting into this beautiful field of energy. Now, I see this beautiful field. This is beautiful purple field. You might see it as a different color. There's no wrong way to do this. And you don't lose any sense of identity. What you lose is any sense of limitation. So you still feel like yourself. You're still aware of yourself but you feel yourself being loved and supported and held in this beautiful field of energy that in fact you are. It is the field of unconditional love. Now, All this field wants to do is to love you and to express that love. And so just allow yourself as you're floating 
in this field of energy. Start to very gently notice what naturally arises from your own heart center. What would you love? What would you love to experience? What miracle do you want to claim for yourself? Now, if you are having any health challenges, let yourself feel those health challenges melting away into this field of energy and you feel your body is a body of light. And allowing this beautiful, unconditional love, this beautiful light vibration to be restoring your body temple to perfect health, tuning it to the frequency of unconditional love. If you're having any emotional or relationship things that you would really love to experience a miracle, let yourself feel the field of energy responding to your desire, dissolving any emotional or relationship issues. Feel them melting into the beautiful energy of unconditional love. And any mental strain, any stress, any beliefs, any negativity that's causing you to feel anything less than serene melts away at that beautiful third chakra center. This energy is melting away and allowing yourself to just release that tension into the field of energy which gratefully absorbs it for you and turns it back into unconditional love. And whatever that beautiful deep heart's desire is for you, that thing that you would just love to help you feel fulfilled, to help you feel seen and valued, to help you have even more compassion for yourself and for others. Whatever is in the way of that, allow that to just melt off of you. Any old grief, any lack of enthusiasm, let that melt into the deep end of this field of energy and rushing in its place is unconditional love. Anything that needs to be free around self-expression, releasing any blocks to self-expression, and allowing unconditional love to come in instead. Releasing anything around intuition and higher vision. Letting that melt away and allowing the energy of unconditional love to take its place. And then finally, the energy of connection with your higher self, with the world, this feeling of oneness, any blocks to that melting away and the energy of unconditional love rushing in. Filling all of your energy centers, filling your body temple, filling your energy field. As you feel this oneness with the field of unconditional love. And allow yourself to enjoy the feeling of oneness. Now, very gently, whatever that beautiful miracle is that you would love to experience, 
now that you've become one with the frequency of miracles, bring it to your mind. Let yourself see the fulfillment of it. Let yourself feel the fulfillment of it. Health miracle, financial miracle, relationship miracle, creativity miracle, whatever that is. This miracle needs to be for you as you let yourself very gently bring that miracle to mind and then release it out of your energy field into the field of unconditional love. And notice how it's creating this beautiful, harmonious resonance as your miracle desire is now out in the field of unconditional love becoming magnified. And we see the waves going out. We feel those waves rippling back to you. Knowing that it is already done. And let yourself receive how loved you are, how adored you are, how cherished you are, how every one of your desires matters to the divine, how everything about you is important to the divine. And let yourself feel that you're being held and supported. That you are being loved. That you are being healed. And whatever it is that you need, body, mind, spirit, you are receiving right now. And when you're in this beautiful field of unconditional love, you don't even have to worry about giving and receiving. It's all one flow of energy. And as you're allowing yourself to feel the truth of this field of energy, you are one with it. Just allow yourself to start sending out waves of gratitude into this field. And we feel those waves rippling right back to us. We send out waves of gratitude anyway. And now very gently we feel Mother Mary's energy behind you starting to move up just a little bit as her form starts to emerge from the field of unconditional love. Very gently she is moving your beautiful body temple up as well. You are still relaxed up against her energy, but starting to emerge out of the field of energy, starting to feel your individuality again. Very gently. Allowing yourself to stay in this energy of feeling held and loved and supported, knowing that all things are possible. If you have tears that need to come, let them come. If you need to giggle, let yourself giggle. There's no wrong way to be. 
As Mother Mary is now sitting completely upright and has you upright as well, your whole body now, you can feel your body temple separate from that beautiful field of energy, but now you're feeling that field of unconditional love energy within you. So rather than it being outside of you and you merging into it, now you're feeling like, oh, this is actually was in me the whole time. So knowing that you can come back to this place at any time. Offering up a prayer of thanks and gratitude. Mother Mary now very gently taking her hands off of your shoulders and then coming around and putting her hands on your feet to ground you. And just let yourself imagine that you can see and feel the energy of Mother Earth rushing up and connecting with the bottoms of your feet, that beautiful Mother Earth energy coming up through your feet and ankles and up through the calves and into the knees. It's a very soothing but a very grounding energy as it moves up through the thighs and into the hips. Now Mother Mary very gently taking her hands off of your feet as you are getting more and more grounded. Mother Mary allowing this energy to move up the spine into the middle and upper torso, moving down the shoulders and into the arms, moving up the neck into the head. Until you see and feel yourself loved and supported by Mother Earth. And recognizing that Mother Earth also is in the field of unconditional love and that anytime you connect with the natural world, you can tap into that vibration that is already within you. So very gently now, move the fingers, move the toes, whatever works for you. Keeping your awareness of this beautiful space of miracles within you. And taking one more deep breath with me. When you're ready, you can open your eyes. All right, my friend. Well, I hope that you were able to go deep into that beautiful field of energy. Know that you can go there at any time. Mother Mary's encouraging you to go there at any time. And especially go there as often as you can during May, which is the month of miracles. You can do it any time of year, but it's especially potent to do it during the month of May. The more we can live in unconditional love, the more we can let go of everything else that's not unconditional love, the faster we'll be experiencing these miracles because we know that the key to magnifying your miracles is to remember that your miracle is already here. All right. Thank you so much, my friend. God bless you. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Thank you for listening to the Magnify Your Miracles podcast. I'm so grateful to be able to spend this time with you. If you want even more inspiration, feel free to visit my website, francisfaden.com or magnifyyourmiracles.com. And if you did enjoy this episode, I would really appreciate it if you left a review on iTunes, Stitcher, or wherever it is that you connect with awesome podcasts. Remember, the key to magnifying your miracles is remembering that your miracle is already here.